Hello everyone, welcome again and today I'm going to show you demo of our trend reservation system project in JSPN Servlet. So before directly dive into the demo, let's talk about the technology that we are using here. It's using MVC architecture, you can see the controller are there. And uh, uh, to manage the front-end side, it's using JSP and to manage the server side it's using servlet to manage the model side or database transactions it's using jdbc data resources uh, jdbc things and to backend that's using mysql to deploy the application it's using tomcat 8.5 uh, on localhost and to manage the backend things it's using mysql as i said and now here i have a mysql workbench and in the MySQL workbench, we have a database trend reservation system which have multiple tables, booking trends, trend type, and the users. Uh, now, in the user table, if you see, we have a two role IDs, different different role IDs. So, this one always for the admin and two always for the user or the customer. So, let's run the application and check how the things are working over there. So, to run the application, I just right click here, go to run as run on server. Select the server, click on finish. Automatically, application will launch over the configured browser. And in my case, it's Chrome. So if you take the project from code one, we will leave the project in this condition at your machine. So after that, you just have to run the application. So we have a complete remote support to configure the project at your machine. So you can go with that. We'll share all the details. How can you grab the project from us? Uh, at the end of this video so till now let's watch the demo how the things are working so the application is launched now this is the home page and under the home page we have a, a simple message over there another option we have a search train if you want to search any train i can search from here we have an option to search by um, from location to get location but right now there is only one record that is this link here we'll add some record and we'll see the functionality that will be not over there Another option we have a sign up option so a user or customer can sign up there. We'll see that also. But for now, let's log in as an admin and check what admin can perform and then we'll move to the customer. <coughs> so here in the database, we have a user ID for the username for the admin user, and this is the password. So I'm gonna enter this username and the password and hit the sign in button. The main important module we have here after signing as an admin, we have a train. So as an admin, I can add a new train. So let's suppose I want to add a train. So let's say new train. This is the name. Uh, okay, the train number. I enter some random number and the rate. So price this should be there. So let's suppose I enter any number. Date. This is the schedule date. So I can enter today's date so 12 so that's not that's 13 now I can add any previous date as well so from so it's asking for the from the exact like door to Mumbai I should put maximum seat let's suppose we have a seat uh, 42 click on save so this train is saved now now in the search train also we have to see that to record now in the view train list we have an option to search train by its name so let's suppose i want to search this train by name so i just search it here so the data is filtered accordingly let's reset another option we have a delete so i can check this and click on the delete automatically it will delete the data i can edit the record as well so let's suppose i want to edit the name so i can edit the name so name is edited now all the code operations are there so here another section we have a booking trends so this will display the bookings that done by the users as an admin i can check that but we have recently created this trend and there is no booking for that so, so it does not display here other common option we have my profile change password and not i logged out and let's suppose i'm a new user and how can i book a train uh, ticket here so register as a user i simply enter the new user and the username new one two three and enter the password i enter demo at the rate one two three date of birth so i just enter the thing date of birth and just enter and the email id so suppose i create an email id 
this and the 10 digit valid phone number is entered click on the sign up <clears throat> so remember the username is this and the password so when I registered the register is successful now if I go <clears throat> and search here for the new user the new user is inserted into the database so here is the username and the password that is also I remember I logged in here enter my username and the password that I just entered I sign in here I can sign in and in the search train section I can see the newly added train here if I want to book a train <clears throat> also you can verify now the search option let's suppose I want to search a train from Indore to Mumbai Indore to Mumbai it will display the filtered record here okay now I want to book it currently if you see the availability of available seats are 42 so I book some seat and when I click on the book button I need to enter the number of person at 10 person it says book of two and one child so let's enter one one so and click on save so two tickets are booked now and if I see now it's remaining only 40 so it's automatically decreased the availability uh, like, uh, after booking the train okay <clears throat> if it is zero it will not allow to book a train okay under this booking now I can cheat now I can check my bookings also I have an option to cancel it so I can cancel it at any time I have another option my profile change password and log out also now if you see in the search section now the newly added record is available and we can search it from here also so this is all about the trend reservation system <coughs> in JSP and Servlet so if you want the source code you can mail us over the J code one at the gmail.com or you can whatsapp us the detail is there in the corner um, our team will help you to share the course code source code also we have the services to uh, run the project setup complete configuration at your machine and it will be good for your interview and all the things so you can buy the project from code one uh, before uh, go for it please check all the details and in the description so you will get uh, in the description you will get a link uh, where you will get all the detailed technology details and the price and all thank you